<laughs> I'm not where I want to be But I'm in what was once a dream So if I do some quick math The future equals a dream come true Since 1992, In All Honesty, a podcast by Olive Orawo. Alrighty, welcome to another episode of the In All Honesty podcast. My fabulous name is Olive Orawo and today we have the people who are lucky in love, we'd say. <laughs> I don't know if... Uh, Anyway, we'll get to here. We'll get to here. Today we are talking about the success side of love. I don't know whether it's success, but basically it's just we've the side the side that has lasted thriving for now. Yes. Because <laughs> <laughs> last week we had the singles here, and mm-hmm. let me tell you, emotions ran high because <laughs> where. Um, thank you so much for coming, ladies, and You're I'll welcome. give you the chance to just introduce yourself as you'd like to be known. And if it's okay, you want to share, you can tell us if you're in a relationship, what stage is it in, how long, yeah. Uh, my name is, uh, should I say Mary Lim? No. Whichever you want. Uh, the Lone Jaber on all social media platforms. Yeah. And uh, I can say I'm in a happy place for now. If that changes, I'm the kind of person to say, I will not keep quiet about that. Mm. And um, I've known him for a very long time. I can say a total of seven, eight years. We were friends for five years. We've dated for two and a half. Not dating like we've been in a relationship for marriage, two and a half years. Yes. Yeah. Serious yeah. relationship leading to marriage. You know. We yes, and uh, on paper, I'm a wife. But yeah. until the day he sees, like he goes, oh, me, I want, um, and he knows this. Me, I want, uh, what's the name of this guy? I don't know if you know him. He sings Luo songs. Um, Okoth Jarapogi. That's the guy that I want. That guy has to sing in my mother's compound. That's all oh, I want. Oh, okay. Yeah. And my, <laughs> the entire village needs to know that I got married. So people will be dancing the entire night. Okay. Yeah. So when you mean on paper, it's... Of- on Legally, I'm a wife. If anything oh, is to really? happen, yes. But then now you want the whole... You want yeah, the he women has to, to Ali leave the couch. Yeah, he yeah. has to... Legally, I'm a wife in that. You've signed the papers. Yes. Oh, oh, nice. Yeah, yeah. Oh, wow. I didn't know I was getting someone who's like official, mm-hmm. official. Yeah. Yes, yes, <laughs> yes. I'm legally a wife, but yes. we are yet to do now the entire process. Okay. Yeah, because I want him to go on his knees, probably in Mount oh. Kenya or somewhere. Oh, cool. mm, you want the whole yes. shebang. Yes. Whole I really yes. understand. I get mm-hmm. it. Mm-hmm. Yes. Uh, my name is Sonia. Uh, but my friends call me Nana, Nana Kitusa, on all platforms, I guess. Um, I have been in a relationship for now five years. This is the fifth year. But mm. I knew him for three years. Uh, we were friends for three years before we started dating. He pursued me for three years. Mm. Yeah. yeah and he to get. But for three years? For three years. Consecutively, like, I want you, I want you. Yeah. But I was in a bad place, so I waited for myself to heal, so mm-hmm. that he would I wouldn't bleed on someone who didn't cut me. Yeah, mm-hmm. so, and you know, hurt people, hurt people. So, mm-hmm. I waited to a point where I was good mentally, emotionally. And yeah, we've been dating for, yeah, this is the fifth year. Yeah, we are in fiancé level. Yeah. Okay. Hey, got OGs. You know me, I was expecting people for one year to come to <laughs> 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 I was expecting to could ever say me. I mean, a serious relationship has been six months. Uh, no, yeah. No, no, oh, this no, is so no. good. This is so yeah, good. Yeah. Um, so I'll get into usually I put out prompts on my socials and people yeah. send in their opinions and their yeah. stories, mm-hmm. and that's what will be our talking points. So that's what I'm gonna read out and then we can just get to discussing. Discuss. All right. Success side of love. Mm-hmm. So the prompt I put out on my socials was um, what does it take for the relationship to keep going? Last week, kuna single moja lisema for a relationship to work, kuna mtu moja ni fala. Kwa hiyo. Um, I wouldn't say mtu moja kwe fala. <laughs> but then we all do value different things. Mm-hmm. Like, 
I know for me my passion and food. Mm. So even when I don't feel like cooking, nitakuwa fala in that situation because I know that's one thing that will definitely calm him down. Mm. Yeah, he's having a bad day at work or me I'm a very crazy person as well. I've just done my own things to him. Food will definitely calm him down. Mm. He also knows situations where he has to maybe go down for me to be happy. Mm. I love to travel so you'll find he just do ni sema aje unaona ni kama ni fala but he knows what he's doing yeah. so he atakuwa fala book me that trip make me happy but he knows why he's doing that because he wants the relationship to stay mm. nitakuwa fala will wake up at 5 am to cook for him because maybe he has a serious meeting he's not going to eat the entire day so unakuwa fala with something in mind you mm. there's something you want So yeah. fala is basically compromising yes, yeah. situation like the women also you find they don't want to drive or they don't know how to drive and they don't like ubers they don't like taking public transport so mm-hmm. this person has to be driven actually everywhere they go mm-hmm. so other people their friends what are like nani anakuanga fala na shinga beba bibi yake everywhere but yeye anajua kwa nini he's doing that to his wife mm. okay. yeah so yo kukua fala is relative amu unapata somebody um like the example I was telling you before Mm-hmm. He knows maybe you may be allergic to cold so in the morning you can't do things involving cold water and maybe you live in a house that doesn't have heated uh, uh normal water yeah. yeah so you will find this person doing dishes and all these things wewe ukiingia kwa nyumba yako you're saying go jamani fala he knows why he's doing that mm-hmm. even women these things women do nambiwa oh we know why we are doing those things and let me tell you, there's nobody who's going to live with somebody else for 2 3 4 5 years and see these things what wana sema ni fala and stay there without a purpose they know why they're there mm. yeah and some of us really look nice out here it's nice when you see us when we with other people but you can't live with us when you're naishi na sisi ndio wanajua so ukiona tukikuwa fala doing some things we also have faults that those people are covering right. yeah yes Where in deep was so deep i never thought about it in that sense mm-hmm. you agreed nash yeah kwa fala inaweza kwa different perspectives kwa fala inaweza kwa umse maybe one or two times ame kwa ibisho kwa nje ni msamea what it was fala maybe ume mwa ibisho kwa nje one to two times ame itwa fala wewe unafanya nini bado na nana eh ni mimi ningekuwa na ningekuwa wewe ningekuwa nisha like for me i am not a morning person like at all eh nikasirika asubuhi like so uh we had this couple on your come come alafu they were like oh me i take out my 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 guys hata mwenye ajwangi atavaa nini mimi ndo ndamtolea kila kitu ndampigia pasi you know yeah mimi na chali yango tukaangaliana tukacheka tukasema nana na jwanga kitu ni divaji yoni jua zubui mm. she's not so unaona yeah go yeah. chalia kama mbia we ni fala like mbona uko na demo yako na kosaje kupigia basi mbona uko na demo ya kupigia ngi pasi mbona uko na demo mwenye amkangi mbele yako unaona yeye aliambia ni fala yeah aya mimi na fridays ataenda dunda mimi don't do dunda so mm. ameenda oh you don't want to, he doesn't want to spend time with you why for like no it's okay Yeah. So na kwa situation mimi ndo fala. Ju mm-hmm. utaambiwa and people are cliche. Watu watakuwa like, "Eh, ameenda, amerombosewa na mademo wengine." Mm. Uko like, "Okay." They're like, "Ai, anakutumia vibaya." Mm. But vile mm-hmm. amesema, "Sisi tu ndo tunajua kuishi nao watu vile iko." Mm-hmm. Cuz me watu wengi wataniangalia wako like, "Ai, mungu kwa demu yangu." But <laughs> yeye yeah, tu ndio anajua kwa demu. Mm. Eh, cuz I am a headache. Yeah. Mm. I am emotional I'm an emotional wreck like you have your episodes you have your so you kwa fala you know man it's okay okay but when you fala wangu na mimi fala wako what people should also understand mm. uh, marriage and relationships are like a business I'm not going to tell you the entire story yeah. I'm not going to tell you everything why I'm letting something slide mm-hmm. like this lady who was trolled on Netflix what's, what's her name to baba's wife oh yeah oh ani dibia uni wani before to baba mm. what's ani's net worth right now sorry yeah so 
sometimes people stay well to on anifala but they have their reasons yeah. for staying okay. yeah so unless your yeah, reasons for staying do not trust me if she was unhappy enough she would have left she's I not unhappy so. i don't think so no Same. i think so unifala na siko ba no unifala now you going to get let children me. out there and uh, i am your wife eh hey, unifala uh let me t- uh, tell you one thing if okay the other thing is disclaimer i was brought up in a polygamous family oh, okay. ah a lot now makes sense and i i, I called people to come for that episode i was I brought up in a polygamous it. family mm-hmm. yeah. so if if my man ever gets to watch this me me i'm not leaving because other women me i will give you a headache but i'm not leaving <laughs> honestly you would you would, you would at he, say, you like say, I, I, i don't have any intentions of having a kid right now but oh, he gets okay. a girl oh, who's yeah. willing to have a kid mm-hmm. with him right now mm-hmm. my life does not change okay. find a way of providing for that kid mm-hmm. find a way of maintaining that family i'll be happy trust me but, but polygamy is okay. different polygamy is an arrangement you're not sema so this is just polygamy that has not been legalized i have an for it um, yeah, no. Two no for it dibia it's it's too much but what i'm mm-hmm. saying is wo- a woman will not stay in a yeah. situation where they're not benefiting but i thought women are like are like sensitive when it comes to she is definitely even, benefiting no, so mkimwita fala she knows thought, what she's getting from it yeah, i can't do you know that people who are not hurt by that the same way you unaona mm. you're saying you're not hurt when your boyfriend goes to the club kurombosiana yeah. mm-hmm. mawadi mwingine uh-huh. maybe No, yeah, uh, nevermore, sasa yeah, unaona yeah. kama mimi i will get hurt if my boyfriend went somewhere without me oh, somewhere yeah. for fun yes but now so, when he has unaona, a second wife si atakuwa anaenda na yeye bila wewe who i said that i said the only mm. thing that nothing in my child. life is supposed to change oh, yes child, yes, yes. Stays, see that life. child at your free time mm-hmm. visit your other wife at your free time mimi my life has to continue if you used to go to church together we go to church together oh, okay. my entire life continues okay. you're the one who mm-hmm. sees you have enough time and enough resources to bring another person so allocate those extras and what if he wants you to raise that baby why would he want me to if i wanted to raise a baby i would have my own oh nice what about adoption you don't want a child but what about not for now oh, that's yes nice. i, I think that. it's a It's a dicey I think it's a dicey situation in the sense that women we were we were raised so that marriage was our ultimate goal mm-hmm. and maybe that's the thing maybe Ani Dibia is going through cuz Nigeria in itself is a patriarchy infested yeah. I don't think she's going through that No she's not honest. going through that yeah. but, but I'm thinking but these things yeah there's a lot of humiliation Unaona no, no, your humiliation is is what we are talking about that what you could want afala nyinyi mna muona afala but you know you, yeah. did you see that she was licking that guy's head eh? would you do that if somebody disgusts you she was licking whose head yeah, i think uh, to baba's the head is a, is like a thing. The head, the head, yes the she did this yeah. on the head like licked yeah, the head humiliation head. no yeah, i can't take such humiliation actually we fala in some things that are unknown no, so actually, that is what club, we are talking it's about it's unknown i'm not there Mm. But una pia na tu watoto one after the after imagine niambi tu ni polygamous to to arrange unaweza And you bring me the kids to raise So like, you don't know what she and to baba are talking gaining. about oh, yeah. yes yeah. and you don't know what she's gaining why she's not leaving So what we kona what tukimwona fala you don't know what mm-hmm. move she's pulling oh, yeah. yes okay. So it it works either way you can be uonekana fala for good reasons like you're protecting your partner maybe oh, yeah. yes yeah. or you have motives unaonekana mm-hmm. fala for a time being he karibu niseme mtu we so maybe she's planning something so when mm-hmm. she does it people will be like oh That no wonder yes yeah. but i or think she just or maybe there's for some the money you really can tell you kuonekana fala in a relationship people who stay, sleep together oh, yeah. you really can tell my mom says what yeah. on na uchi Mm, yeah. 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 You li- yeah, yeah oh, same way. But also there's the, same there's way there's the something idea. that you've talked about yeah, yeah. about uh, I don't know I I I'm not sure if I can say it. Mm-hmm. Say it. About your child. Mm-hmm. So the people now mm-hmm. who know your uh, partner mm-hmm. when they get to find out. Yeah. What on your partner ni fala? Do you know that? But yeah, why yeah, are you yeah, with yeah, a woman yeah, who yeah. has a child? Oh yeah. Yeah. Mm. yeah why are you fathering a child who's That not yours, not yours. Yeah. yes 
Yeah. Kwanza watakuwa mwachomwambia utaenda kukulwa na baby daddy like they tell him so they many have things. Told him so yes. many things that ati hata kireizu huo mtoto at some point huo um mtoto ataenda kutafuta babake. Yeah, Sasa unaona anaonekana mm-hmm. fala. Yeah, yeah, But yeah. Wh- why is he doing that because he knows yeah. maybe he loves the child yeah. or maybe he, he knows that child, child is yeah. your happiness so he mm-hmm. loves the child in extension. Yeah, they actually love the children in extension. Yeah. And so does the child. The child so I'm telling you mambo ya watu wawili Yeah. Achana yeah. nayo. Mtu ataonekana afala so many different ways. Yeah. Yeah. You okay. can respect that. But Wait. for to baba's wife <laughs> The point I was I was trying to make. Okay, let's not use her as an example. She she has something to gain because mm. you can see. Yeah. But we've seen women stick it up in relationships that Honestly don't make sense there's not mm. even that money yeah. or respect yeah. so at times it's also the notion that has been passed down for african women that marriage is all marriage is your all so you see mm. for mm. for us who have achieved so much more but we are not married there's yeah. still a level of disrespect mm-hmm. because so maybe some women feel the pressure to hold on mm-hmm. even if there's not much yeah for it. but that's abusive It is. And as you've said, if you're in a if you're in a marriage where you're not gaining anything, just leave. leave. Yes. I hope that we are now saying it out loud more so that you feel comfortable to leave when when there's nothing to it. But also as somebody who watched your episode, yeah, last um the last one, the singles, the singles, yeah. So when you watch such kind of things, they kind of make you not want to be single. Mm-hmm. And also with the fact that people have known you to be in a relationship when you go back to being single now it's different you're not even that get or single you like plus 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 <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you in the rude streets now bad, it's bad. Streets, yeah. so for, um, I would also say if you're in a relationship please have a support system mm-hmm. have people around you who will tell you the truth mm-hmm. and people who love you whether you're in a relationship or no. you're not yeah. yeah that will make it easy for you to walk out and if you need to because we have met people who the smallest inconvenience are like mwache i sit down with my mama like, if you want to talk to me talk to me directly because yeah. people will <laughs> people will, will tell you very crazy things ati ati ali ati ali fanya nini mwache and you you actually listen to that advice alafu una kaona jiangalia some na shida mnarudiana alafu I think most relationships in those you work wacha kwambia watu shida zako. Yeah, don't. Mm-mm. Papa will disagree. Really? Please. If you need a microphone to air out your problems, please do. Just air it out to the right people to the right because people, you're yeah. going to keep quiet and get yourself killed in no, that. No, 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 you're not going in, to keep in, quiet in, and in get terms depressed. as in atijiweke, but in terms of you're telling everyone like my friends are everyone here. Everyone is a problem, but please Maybe yeah, my mom, problems. my mom is okay. Choose, choose like, people yeah, to tell, choose yeah. Yeah, very important people to tell. Mm. People who you know are sober minded, they won't just tell you because this is what happens and I've seen this in a, another relationship. Unakuja unatuambia makosa zote za chali yako, zote kutoka mbele hadi nyuma, tunamjua vile wewe unamjua. He has cheated on you, he has baby other children like like ame amefanya a lot, mm. a lot. Then bado uko na yeye. Sindo tuna yes hiyo ina kafala but woke him some hair sisi hatujam some hair because you mm. brought it to our door so pia sisi tuko na beef na yetu kwa like unacheza msichana wetu so in some situations have a friend who is sober minded atakwambia by the way si poor jaribu kufanya hii na hii na hii do the first advice what I'm going when things get hard in a relationship ni mwache wachana na yeye wanaume wengi wache mwache anakusumbua na kukula kichwa mwache tutakutafutia mm. mwingine you know but at the end of the day unafaukae pia ujue mtu wako ukiona hizi vitu zinakulemea because mm. half the time tukienda tukushare hizi vitu we just want other people to tell us what we already know yeah. but you do not have mtu if it's abusive leave hata kama amekupoint hivi leave hizo ni zile za kuenda because they back before they bite mm. so at the end of the day hizo ndio nasema ofai kwa tikujiekea But at least you aliacha sufuria kwa sink. Ushaambua ache mtu akupatie heshima. And people out here say, say a lot of dumb things. Yeah. Maybe anachanga socks kwa nini? Huwa kupatie heshima muache. Mm. Utaacha five year relationship kwa sababu mtu ajuku like socks zake. I tell I tell people not to come for me 
to come to me for relationship advice because my advice is always leave for mm-hmm. me it's always just leave but mine is informed by if you are so unhappy why yeah. it, why do you keep telling me about it mm-hmm. Mm. if I, i also don't have the capacity to keep listening to you mm. every other time about a marriage that isn't working out it's, it's you in that marriage it's you who knows what you're gaining in that marriage it's you yeah so if you come to me and tell me you're going through a hard time i can say if you're not happy leave no not that mm-hmm. in, in the beginning um me and him are going through a rough patch Let's go out, let's go for a girls okay. date, let's do like that is okay. But if you constantly complain about this person, sitaki kumskia tena chagua vile unafanya and me if you're not happy, leave. It gets tiring. Yeah. It also puts a strain on your relationship with the people around you mm-hmm. because they start treating you as fragile because of your relationship because you will find your friends also are going through things like me they can't call you because they know the moment they call you you're you going to start with your yeah 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 When we're together all we talk about is your failed relationship. Mm. And me I call out I call out my friends I'm like what I'm seeing here is a streak of where you're enjoying you on enjoy Vrutano. There are people yeah. who are also Toxic. sometimes you don't know the trauma you're carrying. Mm-hmm. It's only manifesting in some ways and you don't know. So I'll tell you where happen is Stockholm syndrome. Talk to a therapist. Me I'm not certified. So it's things like those. So also yeah, true the audience you're giving. Um hiya someone here said I'll re- I'll remind you the prompt what does it take for our, um for the relationship to keep going this person said communication hakuna kitu nyingine when people say communication because <laughs> cause this is what the singles are complaining about as well mm-hmm. what does communication look like now in an actual relationship uncomfortable conversations communication in a relationship depends are you guys living together or not the kind of conversations you're going to be having when you're living together mm-hmm. are very different mm-hmm. compared to the co- uh, conversations that sh- you will have when you're not living together and also it depends on the person you're dealing with you're dating maybe um an auditor <laughs> trust me you're not going to be calling this guy yeah you will call and call and call he'll come back at nine. Call, oh well, let me ping here mm. and honestly he's serious he's just a corner yeah. yeah so to come away you need to know your person you need to know their uh, work schedule you need to know also the kind of um, communication they prefer there are people who like chatting i don't like chatting <laughs> you text me i will leave you there mm. come back and respond five hours later disappear again so it depends mm. so they things that people are talking about that he, you get a lady she's uh, texting you good morning my king have you eaten did you sleep well you're also just dating um an idol person yeah stop dating idol people and stop <laughs> dating people who don't love themselves <laughs> so when you communicate it's effective communication and it's necessary mm. communication and then when you live together dynamics change you're not going to ask me umekula nini well to look like a so the conversations also change mm. yeah so communication i think in a relationship when people say you need communication it's yeah. not communication ya umeamka aje my sunshine no mm. it's communication ya what do you want me to do um when do we do this mm. like progressive communication communication that brings a change to your life communication that makes your relationship better and i don't think asking somebody who mekula nini will make their relationship your relationship better unless you want to send them food even as the singles are tutaki kuuliza what mekula nini yeah so. <laughs> so if you're asking me ni mekula nini maybe i am sick yeah. and you know i haven't been feeding well oh, yeah. and mm-hmm. what follows is after umekula nini i tell you no is that ting 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 mpesa or maybe delivery. double rings yeah. sent delivery but you make kula nini with nothing for it mm. it's a waste of time yeah, yeah. you said hard conversation yes hard conversation 
conditions, mm-hmm. especially for someone who is young in a relationship. Kuna conversations what ongezele yangu finances. Mm. Aya wewe li grow up aje na mimi ni grow up aje na tutaka maji pamoja tuone vile tutaishi pamoja. There are some households budaki afanya ngi anything. Mm-hmm. Then kuna ingine budaki anafanyanga almost everything. Mm. Yeah naona hiyo ni kukaliwa. Wewe yeah. unaona it's a, it's a form of love. Mm-hmm. Naona mm-hmm. mimi kama mimi I was raised by my dad. My dad literally has my mom was working. My dad ndiye alikuwa na liquid like a job yenye anaweza tushughulikia. So he gave us everything. So lazima mm. nikikuta mseni wangu mimi ni hivyo bango anaenda out of his does everything for us. Yeah. Na yeye pia ametoka from a place where babake ashikangi hata kikombe. Yeah. You know such conversations mnaona mm. by the way it tutaleta uh, having a child in the picture my son yeah lazima pia to gauge um toto tutamlenyaje you know na wewe ndio baba yake si ndio hautakuwa uh, unaruka saa zingine when mm-hmm. things get yeah. hard because like pigia baba yake no mm-hmm. because it is standard for hours baba yake ayuko ni wewe uko such mm-hmm. conversations her finances una ingilia wapi na mimi ingilia wapi kwa sababu a lot of young people una 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 date cash cow chali hapa sipo kutumia nywele una jam mm. and respect you need to respect mbona tufai kuja mm? mbona tufai kuja kwa sababu up until huyo mwanaume achukue responsibility for you this is just my view up until like bwana kwa kwambie will you marry me ama vitu kama hizo hizo mm. vitu sumbua wazazi wako nywele i'm dating you it's just dating imagine sumbua babako kwa sababu so I... unapatia huyo mwanaume responsibility si yake and ndio maana vijana wengi wanaona why are you saying responsibility si yake? yake if that's what the two of you have decided on mimi i go do my hair today nitauliza nimetoa wapi pesa unajua wewe already msha establish this is for my yeah so i think those conversations but at sasa tuna date at sasa mtoto mm. brother yangu amealiza high school ndio miaka yamwambia mlipie nywele that is sumbua babako sumbua mamako that is your parents job mm. but sasa watu wanaanza kujipatia responsibilities sio zao kwa relationship wewe chali yako sasa huyo tu msichana mwenye anaitisha nails na nywele chali yako akakwambia sasa hii nataka nguo si in a relationship it's do for me i do for you may choose my 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 boyfriend's clothes when i go shopping niko like yeah perfume zake ni mchagua hiyo because i know this is for marriage but ingekuwa ti sasa tu anaishi kwake na mimi naishi kwa kwa nini afanye hiyo yangu that's not fair mm wasichana wache kujifanya the mini tunaingia kwa relationship umeacha kujitegemea kama mtu wazazi wako especially if they are alive for those fortunate enough to have like living parents sumbo baba yako mwambie dad i need my hair done that is yeah. your father it's, it's part of his job description yeah. but usianze kusumbua vijana wewe wenyewe oh nataka hii nataka ile nataka ile wanaume pia uchoka and that adds on to their mental health so at the end of the day difficult conversations ina hii ina hii ina hii mm. ukifika hapa nataka ufanye hivi meaningful conversations pia vile unasema si ati atijua kuku text jana Hey, good morning umefura kama ndazi shua mtu ako na vitu za kufanya actually nikisema na siezi date mtu ana kazi it's because i don't want an idol person huyo yeah. akuni text good morning sunshine sija reply umefura unafurisha nini i have things to do uja reply ameongeza <laughs> voice note <laughs> like you didn't hear you didn't have a good life entertain those men ni 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 umechoka kusoma shika usiki mtu mwenyewe ni wote mmetoka job mnajua jioni it's just having a good time to make a movie like me me and my boyfriend it's our love language i think is movies we will just to have a very difficult day but jioni tunajua tu eh kuna ka movie kali tokea jana let's do that movie let's sit have a nice meal i cook for my everything he wants lakini si kiusu you know but mm-hmm. yeah you get like i just i make good meals and i know anajua kwa na safe space akitoka job anajua no judging tutakam tutahavizo conversations about 
ye amekuaje siku yake na mimi nakuaje siku yangu tutaka ka movie nataka atalala half of it but you know it's something I'm bonding yeah. i think communication to me and this is in reference to what the single say mm. the things communication in a relationship depends on the stage your relationship you can't mm. meet me today and then you start asking me how are we going to parent our child <laughs> Really? children are we going to have exactly <laughs> so communication will vary mm. depending on the stage where you are at because let me tell you it gets so hectic mm-hmm. to the point that sometimes you just wake up and you're like hey ulilipa ile kitu pigia nani like that's where your life is at at that moment And then the day is still even if you're dating a busy man you wake up to good morning sunshine. Yeah. 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 So it depends on where your relationship is at. And that's some of the things that scare the single people especially men. You've met a girl three weeks in. She starts asking you, "Where do you see yourself in five years?" Goodness. <laughs> <laughs> I've only known you three weeks. How am I supposed to be sharing my whole life plan with you? I'm not even sure yeah. if I like you yet. Because three weeks, I'm not even sure if I like you yet. Maybe that feeds into compatibility. You see how you meet someone and they have a five-year plan and you also have a five-year plan. So you're kind of the same person. Yes. And then maybe that's something to talk about. On. Yes. Yeah, maybe. yes, yes. No, what we're talking about is communication in relationship side. Mm-hmm. So if you're bonding over that, that's different. This mm-hmm. is intentional communication. Mm-hmm. that somebody ah, sitting yeah. you down now we've gone to a restaurant we've met three weeks ago and you're starting to ask me how we are going to it, mm. it scares people not just women okay women we don't really get scared so much by it we get inspired because now i see my wedding <laughs> dress coming sooner <laughs> yes but for men it's very scary mm. it's very scary because now this is somebody who's not giving you a chance to yeah. walk out of this or stay Mm. they already see you there permanently mm. so mm. i think for me communication i don't think i would have a difficult conversation the way you call it mm-hmm. with somebody i've just met mm. those are things that i will ask you when you tell me now mm-hmm. i want no, you to be my girlfriend be, yeah. yes okay. and then so, most of the times you don't even realize you need to talk about these things mm. a lot you of the don't times, even yeah. realize you have differences Let me tell you when this guy asked me to date him. I remember so well we were at Treasure Garden with Bilenge playing in the background. <laughs> I never thought we would fight even a single day. I never thought. Then we start living together and yeah. we fight about the smallest things mm-hmm. which when we now sit down and look back it's about how we were brought up. Mm-hmm. So my person will never take fish in yemekatwa. Never ever. It's the utmost the What? most disrespectful thing you can ever do to him you can burn his suit you can scratch his shoes do anything else but don't serve him half fish and for What? me my mother umekula samaki mzima peke yako how like fish isn't cut cut no so my has <laughs> where my person <laughs> is not husband yet <laughs> <laughs> he his mother was a fishmonger so they had so much fish in the mm. house and then she would probably come back from work tired she don't want to make vegetables so what she'll do is give you a whole fish no matter the size and then it's probably leftovers so kama inatoshana hivi she'll give it to you all of it and my mother raising four kids by herself that That one fish was serving all was serving all of you. Yes. <laughs> so to him he felt like namkazia. Mm. Because we've been raised very differently. Mm. Like I was telling you before, I'm very frugal. Very 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 frugal. I know what's in my house even now you take me to my pantry I will name to you what's there and what's not there and what needs to be bought. Him he is not like that. He's the kind of person who who will tell you just use it we'll buy another one and for me it's not even about the fact that we can afford another one i feel you're being wasteful it's i, being, I yes, yes yeah. it's being wasteful mm. yeah him so that even interferes with like bulk shopping mm. 
yeye kama kitui kwa hapo it's supposed to be used it's supposed to yeah yes so, and yeah. for me i grew up in a family where if it's there it means it needs to last to last long a certain yeah. time mm. my mom would buy one tin of jam and it would last the whole month trust me ilikuwa inaisha 29th 28th or 30th if you've been raised by teachers you guys know this hey, please oh that's a teacher yes, thing yes yes it used to last those days nalikuwa na kuangalia tu hivi you do the right thing so him he wasn't brought like up like that his mom was hardly home so they just brought themselves up so that changes a lot of things So you can't say this is a conversation we would have had that day at Treasure Garden ningemuliza at how are we going yeah. I would not have known that he eats a whole fish by himself <laughs> Yeah He'd rather eat true. it a bakishe but don't serve him But don't half. cut her mm, yes. Yeah Yeah there's wow. so many things like for me not having butter in the house will get, like I will have a panic attack mm. He doesn't have understand why mm. I have to spend 1200 buy butter He doesn't understand why I must have cooking cream. I don't even take pastry. He doesn't understand that. He says it's the same thing. It's not the yeah, same thing to um, me. Yes. He doesn't understand why uh I need to use certain cook uh cleaning product. Because for him toast, aerial, it's, it's all the <laughs> same. Yes. yes. So those are things that you really can't talk about before. Mm, yeah. True. He doesn't understand why as having a washing machine is saving compared to him as having somebody to clean to wash. every time yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. so these are things you don't see coming you don't see it coming at That's all true. so those conversations change with the changes in your relationship yeah. as well and also right now conversations about parenthood parenting mm-hmm. the one makes sense because i don't even know my parenting style until like, that baby comes Because now I can say I'll be such a sweet man and then that baby comes I beat the hell out of them mm. and he's a sweet parent. So these things change. And then also even about money. Before when we met I was working. Mm. I was taking care of my own things. I was taking care of some other things in the house. Now I'm not. So you see the money conversation That's also change. So yeah. when you say that you're going to have difficult conversations at the start of start of your relationship, most of the time it's not realistic because mm. some of these things are not there. Yeah. And you've also not identified them as a problem. Mm-hmm. So when they come, talk about them. So that's why we say effective communication and communicate as frequently. So when something rises, you deal it with it, with it then. Mm. When we started our relationship, he was only having one job. Now he has two jobs. His timings have changed. Time. Yeah. Yes. So now we need to reprogram how do we get to spend quality time together. These are things we didn't see from the start. We used to have all our evenings together. Now he has so many other things to do. You have school, you have all these things coming in. Mm. Yeah. It even got to a point I relocated. I, I was not in the country mm. for a while. We didn't see that coming when we started dating. So communication is progressive and don't burden somebody with all those things just because you've had people in the internet saying you need to talk about these yeah, things. Yeah, that. Yeah, they come at a certain stage. Where you are at if you're in the talking stage enjoy it go out dance do all those things that people do at the talking stage. Mm. Yeah. Communication is really mm. pain is tricky because people how do you want to communicate certain things talking stage. That's the the talking stage. Yeah. Mkianza kuishi pamoja ongelelen sabuni gani mnaoganga nayo. Leto amesema it's about timing sometimes and also people see settle for something just because people say men are supposed to be busy. Mm. When when your love language is words of affirmation make sure this person knows. Mm. Yota kama hayuko maybe once in a while anakuambia tu kitu nzuri. So by the end of the day tunakwanga huko nje tuko like eh mimi unajua mimi napenda kutextiwa alafu majority of people are like ayo ni yoni ujinga yoni if that is what you want to communicate it mm. I want to be texted I want you to check up on me during the day. Mm. I like gifts I want you to gift me Don't settle for something just because people say a uh, standard in your communication is not enough for come no ngelelea maybe you don't want to talk about kids maybe you just want to be texted imagine muambie and mm. if it's it's not working for you muambie pia yeah because mimi kama mimi i like being checked up on mm. i think my mom taught me that because my mom will call you like twice a day just to know that you're okay mm. so when you love me that is what i know 
haya in terms of kulelewa differently sisi kwetu and i have come to notice that this does not happen in every household sisi kwetu babangu ndo piga pasi juu mm. amwezi piga yake so mm. anapiga zenu cuz iko hivyo like ana anatakanga nguo zake zikiwa certain that, years yeah. so it comes so naturally okay say so ni wakubwa but say i see it with my small brother like akitaka kupigiwa nguo atapigia mamangu atapigia babangu yeah. mm-hmm. na atapigia by the way if there's a function like when we are going to my sister's funeral yeye yeah, alitupigia pasi he was like mm-hmm. later it comes so naturally so nikiambia chambi yangu anipigie nguo pasi ya yeah, ile Hmm. Jukwa wa mama kinda anapiganga pasi. So I'm like you do know this is weird. Nico like we, we've even had that conversation today. Nilikuwa like I think it comes so naturally for me mm-hmm. and I'm sorry but we will compromise where we can. Aya yeye yeah, amezoea finances ni za mwanaume. Mm-hmm. So when it comes to talking about like finances he will take care of it. Ako like nda sort nda sort. He doesn't do 50-50 na sort we mali unaweza saidia saidia but yeah. mimi ndo na sort juu ametoka from a household where it's men making the sorting yeah. school fees rent everything mimi naye nimetoka from a 50-50 home mm. where my mom and my dad both chip in so it's different it's different everywhere mm-hmm. but don't settle for less just because the internet is saying usikule mwanaume wako kichwa na maswali kama hizo mm. if you want communication sit your man down if his name is Kevin Kevin mimi na hii julikani hata tukiendelea huko mbele my love language is this mm. is is kwa tu talking stage ndo una love bomb you alafu huko mbele unaangalia hivyo <laughs> kama emotional nini abuse yeah. to withdraw true ikae kijulikana na nana anapenda communication na nana anapenda tu ukienda dundani ya mtu kwa club fulani because mm. mama yetu i think alitulea kutuambia i would rather know where you are even if it's somewhere i don't want you I to be i don't want you to be here cuz in case something happens mm. sitapigiwa na na uko uko mwili wako umepatikana kisumu mimi najua unaishi mufiga so mm. let me just make a funny comment my mom says mm-hmm. <laughs> don't lie about the direction lie about the thing you're going to do <laughs> yeah yeah <laughs> Naweza kwa na kuombea Mombasa na wewe. Yeah, and I got to understand it by the way Juzi cuz when, when my sister had the accident she lives in Gataka. She was talking to my mom on the phone. So my mom knew hata vile aliona breaking news Gataka nini alijua mtoto wake anaweza kuwa hapo. Rather mm. than sister yangu hata atujua anaishi wapi ama ingekuwa mimi Gataka mm. unaona yangi ona news aseme ah. Yes, ah hii well, inaanguka aje hao watu wataumia hangi waifikiria kwenda kutafuta sister yangu mm-hmm. for heights uko kisumu when something happens in kisumu ama to check you are by anyone mm-hmm. but anana kisumu hata kuwa like hapa na sina na wangu au mm-hmm. ni mwingine huyo so it is very important me for me communication niambie utachelewa niambie because mm-hmm. i am an overthinker woo mimi uko sasa kuingia uliniambia unatoka job 5 na tena ujaingia all the scenarios i have played in my mind mpaka nishapanga mazishi yako niko like oh god i'm going to cry kai <laughs> cause where is he mm. my first place in akwanga are you okay yeah and for him for the longest time ya alikuwa anaona na overreact cause i thought he was cheating no i need to know where i just are. need to know yes yeah. lie about what you're going to do but don't lie about the direction You don't even have to say cheating in Ruaka say you in Ruaka you don't even have to say exactly Ruaka sema uko Limuru road sema tu by the way uko Ruaka ndio no my mom says sema tu direction the, the, the general yes. direction yeah. yeah. cuz unaweza pigiwa imagine unapigiwa naambiwa eh uh, tumepata the name Kevin tumepata Kevin nini naivasha mm-hmm. unajua Kevin ako ST au si Kevin wangu haezi kuwa That would probably be me. And men do not know how to communicate that. They think umwakalia kwa sababu akipiga anekana na maboys amekupigia energy babe and ndo nimetoka job. What ataambiwa hapo eh kwani lazima ajue kila mali unaenda. You know. So they do these things. So, That's the other thing. What about those your friends like separating when your friends are healthy and when they are not? because i think also the the circles you keep as someone's partner feeds a lot into yes. it plants seeds kama hivyo vile 
you see like he, mm-hmm. he knows he's supposed to check up on you your relationship works fine when yes. it's the two of you mm-hmm. but outside mbona mtaki mwambia ati amekukalia it plants a small seed he actually thinks he, about it and I struggled with that for a very long time like angekuwa na come home alafu ananiambia unajua mimi nimeambiwa na boys me hakuna kitu kingi unafanyika kwa nyumba ya mtu niko like mm-hmm. hii ni nyumba yao then it it takes time before nianze kuma explain yeah relationships are different mm-hmm. because sasa mimi hata wewe kuna vitu unafanyanga nikaambia madem wangu sasa hii wako like eh hey, nana toko wao mtu Mm. but you have to understand even circles need to change circle yake time alikuwa single na yeah. circle yake sasa hivi ile tuko pamoja mm. cuz aki hang out kaya tulianza kudieta kiwa 25 i was no, 26 hours 23 the people i had circles with then are not the same people i am with yes some mm-hmm. the important ones watu wenye naona pia wako na akili sio ati madem tulikuwa tunapiganga sherehe kila weekend ndio bado niko nao sai mm. they will tell me all the wrong things they yeah. will tell me anakukazia they will tell me oh like some stupid things zenye you will put into nini lafu when people give you advice unajua kitu tunasa wingi ni even stupid people grow old mm. unaenda lafu una let's say you're in an abusive relationship i was in an abusive relationship And unfortunately the person I told first aliambia vinyilia. Hmm. Was chana uchapwa. Just do better, you know. Yeah. Ongea pole pole. You see that was the first na alikuwa msemze. So me ni kona eh by the way si marriage yake ime last. Maybe this is what happened. Mm. So you also have to say unaona. Wewe unatandikwa tu. Unaona tu vizuri unatandikwa. Unaona vizuri tu unatoka damu. Unaumia you hate yourself because people who are being abused they hate themselves a lot because how dare me how dare i let this happen to me mm. but this okay and their advice from a boys you can their advice from a dem yeah, when you that wanna true. like i wanna you know mm-hmm. i think no matter for marriage best couple you know in a sober people yeah what's your meaning so with the circle minimize everything from the circle even even and domo na na wewe huu kijana wetu tuta tutamchukua tutampatia demu mwingine i've had all sorts of things but at the end of the day it's up, yeah. it's up to him aseme i will not take this advice and i will take this advice and i think it's really nice to date someone who has a mind of their own to think yeah. that your man can your either your partner can be informed their decisions can be informed by someone outside is really sad yeah. because i'm just yeah. thinking kwani ana akili yake yeah i think it all goes back to somebody's personality to be honest it's not even about relationship mm. it's about if you can be convinced about your relationship can be convinced about anything else in your life mm. these That's are people true. who true, they yeah. deep down mm. in her heart she wants to buy a mazda but because i remember a mazda um, mm. the mechanics are was juu vizuri get a Toyota she ends up buying a Toyota which she does not like yeah. so if it's not about relationships only yeah. and if you find that you easily influenced mm-hmm. to leave the person you're with or stay with somebody mm-hmm. then just evaluate everything else in your life you're probably being influenced about so much more in your life than you actually know mm-hmm. yeah. and a lot of times what influences your relationships is who you are yes. it's not so much that the other person is coming yeah. to mm-hmm. complete you mm. Oh, you've brought in an interesting dynamic when you described communication and when you described communication it shows not only is it the stages it's also that particular relationship yeah. so in in a younger relationship let's say the man is 25 the woman is 24 both of you are figuring things out in the career <laughs> scene <laughs> you're both figuring things out in the career scene mm. probably money has not come in like that yeah. so i when you go online and you hear people saying 50 50 is not possible also know the target audience for those like femininity and masculinity yeah. coaches mm. when shira sevens is talking she's not talking about your 25 year old boyfriend she's, not, yeah. she's talking about someone who's mm. going into a marriage it's what is it called yeah, yeah. and she's talking she's not all soul talking about a 25 year old girl mm-hmm. and even a 30 year old girl that 
those are the things that people don't realize yeah. Yeah. and then the things that she's talking about she talks about she does not say you put them all in one situation yeah. Yeah. because this is the same woman who tell you to marry an ad mm. yeah she tells you to marry smart people this is the same woman who will also tell you like those things are conflicting they're conflicting because they are meant for different situations mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. yeah yes 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 yes, 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 yes. yes. what kind of because yeah because at the end of the day watu wanakaanga wanafikiria kwa sababu relationship yake nikasa mimi nifikie home nianze kwambia chali yangu wewe unajua nini chali yake anaweza oshaviombo wewe mbona oshangivyo not everything applies to everyone and then also you can take um you can't take her advice when you yourself you know that woman trust me you will sprinkle and sprinkle dust <laughs> because yourself you're a dusty and then you expect you're going to sprinkle somebody's sand who's been polished no it yeah. doesn't work like that sure, it does not work like that you. the other day i told people that mimi i pray to get a good man i wasn't telling you to pray for mm-hmm. that dusty you have to change Mm-hmm. until pray that you make the right decision from the start mm-hmm. and how are you going to make the right decision you have to be the right person also oh, yourself yeah. Yeah. yes yeah. yeah yeah so some of these things that we talk this problems that we talk about in relationship because yes you sprinkle a ceo do you know you can make this person come from a ceo to be a nobody mm-hmm. just by you being in their life yes yeah. yes yes, mm-hmm. yes yes you're going for events with this guy you're drinking yourself silly you're starting to yeah yeah heat on other people because that's what you've been told you're trying to climb the ladder through him you're doing it the wrong way mm. yeah mm. so some of these things advice when people say something look at who they are yeah and yeah context. and who yes 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 so when we tell you have difficult conversations mm. i'm not telling you mm. a 22 year old who's still living with the mom to start deciding at babe to end up with you Really? <laughs> exactly exactly <laughs> yeah, so some of these things sense. don't apply like for me even myself my mom married somebody who was my mom married a student mm-hmm. i'm sad that it didn't work out for her but my mom cleared uh, college very early she was 21 that time those who cleared mm-hmm. college at 21 my mom was really 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 young mm-hmm. so she was dating somebody who was uh No my stepdad was in uh campus then. It worked for them when it worked. Yeah. So you can't these things have no formula to be honest. Just have your common sense, be a sensible person and uh you will figure things out. To add on to that uh Sema you're not the right person. I remember for the longest time we, we were just friction like to got a friction but it is because i want him to be something but i don't want to conform to what he wants mm. so nico like one and hang out eh na pia mimi na hang out so ko like okay nataka u change but miss ko willing to change yes if yeah so i understand because ndio kitu you work lazima ni wote like mm. it's like that that picture where the guy is holding the nini the hiyo kitu ya kugonga na the ladies mna mnachongana mm and up until nianze kuona by the way i also need to change up until then tuko tu tunazozana upala mm-hmm. yani nothing atungeona eye to eye with anything yeah because for me i always want to be right mm. i'm with a person who also always wants to be right yeah so you teach you also teach your man to love you you teach your man because I... who i was with my ex is not who i am with my current mm-hmm. with my ex maybe nilikuwa kitu kingine people will bring out different nini sides yeah, especially yeah. kwanza kama frontal lobe yako kwanza bale ija ija mm. yeah who i was after who i was two years ago with my man is not who i am right now we have changed drastically vile naona world sahi vile naona vitu sahi si vile nilikuwa naona two years ago mm. so even with your person usikwe tu one person no kata yeah. change like yeah. usiogope ku grow at yo ah uh-uh. maybe nikikutana na eh i had this kind of thinking na sai i'm thinking in a different kind of way mm. because also in a relationship if you guys are not growing then you're not doing the right thing usikuwe na mtu ana fuck anaona like akona tunnel vision mm-hmm. na kama si hiyo ataki 
kuliko shana na maboya na kuanga biko wezi ni pikia shida yako mimi na siwezi kuwa na wewe mm. and that's okay also vision. kuna mdem mwenye anataka tu kupikia boyfriend wake mm. yeah, and okay. there huko <laughs> eh yeah. yeah, it's like oh, ma, oh, vijana wenye unajua tu vizuri unasota mm-hmm. alafu unakuja unaanza kufuata dem mwenye ashazoea take out alafu unaanza kumwambia mbona usinipende na na chapo madondo yangu my friend endea watu wa chapo madondo some sacrifices are not worth dance. it because ebu yeah. angalia kama yeah, i want to be her when i grow up yeah? she has the way she's thinking you know mm. yeah yeah how to kujo mwambie ati baby lakini miss nanga pesa sasa unatakaje endea watu bado si pasi no apo i would definitely say you you attract what you are to be honest because People have asked me this. If we stopped dating or living together today, mm-hmm. me I would leave my life. Mm, I would. True. I would. I'm educated. Mm-hmm. Um I don't want to blow you my own trumpet, but, you but can, you one thing is yes, I have lived on my own before. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So mm-hmm. it's something I can I can continue living my life the way it is right now. Or maybe even better, you never know. Because opportunities also do open this, up. This, these are for the girls who think love is everything. Love is not everything. Yeah. And don't be with Thank someone you. who is not growing. Alafu unaogopa kumwacha just cause Chris Chris Martin alimba eh, paper love. No. Mm. no. I think the Bro. goal is to be happy. If she is happy by herself and she feels mm-hmm. whole enough, that's it. If you're happy in a relationship, that's it. Mm-hmm. And things do change. Just like we've said kuna situ- kuna stages mm-hmm. yeah so maybe you my mom is happy alone mm. but she was once happy in a marriage yeah yeah mm. so these things have stages and mm. also when you're taking advice look at the state that person is yeah. in and who they are addressed mm-hmm. yeah don't go for advice from bitter people bitter people will just they'll just bleed on you man yeah true mtu alikuwa anatandikwa wewe umempelekea tu shida kidogo labda tu <laughs> ana changa socks pale yeye ako na machunguza bwanake mwenye alikuwa anamtangiza yeye na watoto wake anakuambia wanaume ni wajinga wanaume they deserve nothing mhm yeye ni kwanza umeende advice kwake make sure pia wewe kama unaweza unaweza sacrifice pia wewe finances zako tu wende uende professional a whole yes. psychologist mtu afikiri na machungu zake mm. because most of the time tunaendeanga mothers in law tunaendeanga some some old women in the society yeah. na watu wa kitambo sijui kwa nini wako na notion ya celebrities umilia <laughs> eh unaenda unaangalia kabi wa jesus mm. uko like eh hey, huyu alivumilia ama ama size 8 alivumilia pia mimi ndavu eh hey, kwanza that reality show is wild that you goes back to which point to lisema Yeah. Tuko kwa fala people. Simp. Oh, men call it simp. Yo kuko kwa fala men call it. Oh, call yeah, it simping. simping. Yeah. Mm. And please find a man who doesn't care about simping. Find your man who worships you. Find a man who Come simps. Come on, Nara Smith. Eh, <laughs> na blue 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 whatever. No, I you guys. Everybody everything has a price. Mm. The things I look at about uh, that guy. Nara Smith. And I'm like if my guy did this. Yes. So many things. I think he looks gay. Oh, oh, Nara Smith. Husband. Yes. Okay, I'll have to look at him. Why you walking around the truth speaking in your mouth all the time? Perfect way watch us. For you. 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 Oh Jehovah, I'd have that many. Now you can't do that to me on. Yeah. Yeah. Very different. Well, yes. So that's why <laughs> I kill them to a corner things that they look at in other okay, people's relationship and I think unifala. Anamwangaliangatu. All different. You yeah. My world. Me don't know there's something about a man looking at someone ana sazile ijulikani ana kucheck it all of ako like when you are go. Ai. We have a hopeless romantic yeah, and a compatibility. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> hopeless romantic. I, 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 think I thought I was until I, I met you. I, 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 I oh, you're a, you think you're a hopeless? I thought no. I was. I grew up in a household and I tell this my I tell my friends this and no one believes me but I'm from a household where I have never seen my parents fight even verbally mm. ever. 
ever to yeah. date. Sijai wana wamekosana. We never me hata siko na joto uko sana. So when I went to my first relationship it was abusive. I was like what is this? Mm-hmm. Honestly, what is this? Because I do not know what this is. Yeah. So coming from that I know how to look at a man who looks at the lady and they're like wow she's mine. Mm. You know, when my dad describes what my mom is to him and I describe a best friend and I describe something so for me that is what I would want. Mm. I would want a man who looks at me and he's like wow I am so lucky to have him. Yeah. I'm sorry you see him gay but me I see him as perfect. Why? Yeah, so people are different. Maybe <laughs> yeah. I want to feel yeah. your action should tell me. Yeah. I, not I, I the guess. way you look at mm. me. Yeah. So we're all different. Hey, as you know, I'll give you single perspective trauma. <laughs> that has also been an issue because we've realized that people banking men banking on that on that whatever she's described men banking on it mm-hmm. a lot of times right now we are seeing more young men using it to to target yes. women who yeah. are a bit more established yeah. women yeah. who look like they have their life mm-hmm. together mm-hmm. so yeah also also just like i guess romance doesn't work as that fairy tale romance mm-hmm. yes yeah yeah quite difficult higher um someone else said bare minimum as a single person it is respect and reciprocity single people opinion last week mm-hmm. um next person says love love or relationship love or relationship is work and both of you must work yes mm-hmm. that keeps me that is one thing that has kept me from a lot of relationships and friendships because they describe it as work but i don't know what exactly is this work that they talk about This goes back to what we said. You stay there knowing what you're gaining from it. Yeah. Would you go to work if some say you were to get maybe another gig, another job, something mm-hmm. else to do on the side and you know it's making your life better? It makes making you happier. Would you do it? And uh, like rent nini is taken care of or like cuz I I need the money from work. Yeah, like you get another job mm-hmm. that is taking care of you. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you're growing financially, you're happier. Would you do it? Would you take it? Yeah. Yeah, so that's the same thing as a relationship I can say for me. Mm. For me I feel my relationship is building me financially. There are things that I would not be able to do or I did not know how to do before. I've learned I was horrible with Excel. Mm. Thanks to the relationship I can like you'll give me raw data i'll put it into excel i'll give you charts and i've mm-hmm. learned that from this like there's so many ways that i've grown mm. in so many areas so for me it's work and it's work that i enjoy doing and it's serving me for now when it stops fine mm. yeah you yes you move for me then. work is work because and this i was taught from a very early age Hakuna mm. relationship ina survive nyingine na mapenzi peke yake. And I'll give you an example of even siblings. Mm. You don't work on your relationship. You're just going to be to lead over kwa tumbo moja. Mm. But work for me doesn't really necessarily mean exhausting. Mm. Yeah. It just means every day you wake up purposeful to make it work. Mm. It is when those days where because if you learn to give up on every okay, maybe My auntie told me one thing and that is my that is what I I, I put in life. Uh, yeah. In life you will have either one person and give them 20 chances or have 20 people and give them each a chance. Yeah. Like so if it is this one person atayo si kwenye mkubo. Yes kwenye una mwangalivu na go like guy what is this I'm with? Na jo kesho bado mnaanza pamoja. When people say it's work, Mimi I just look at it as uh, you're getting a financial advisor who doesn't want to fleece you. Mm. You're getting a how do you call entrepreneur partner? How do you call? An entrepreneur partner. Like if you a into, business partner. Yes, you're getting a business partner. Yeah. You're getting um help in the house. Mm-hmm. You're getting a forever travel mate. Mm. All those things. So for me I find it beneficial that if 
you enjoy being in your relationship. I when people say marriage is work, it's like working for a company that you really enjoy working with. You so there are those days when boring. you wake up and you're cramping and you don't want to go to work, but you still have to go. Yeah. So that's the same thing. Mm, okay. Yeah. No, for yeah. me, work is work because it is work. Because at the end of the day, kuna sauta angalevi ataki lala tuko like bye. Fani na mtu. And for women, I think it's worse. It's also sometimes you can't really control it. Yeah. <laughs> I usually tell my yeah, person right. that there is a wake up and I feel like I want to sell him. Like, yeah. 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 You just wake up and you you're so upset. You don't even know why. And now those are the days like you really need to be with somebody who is intentional about being mm-hmm. with you and loving you. Because I will wake up and I'm mad at you for no reason. No reason at all. You ask me two days, I'm just like, I don't know. I'm just like, I don't know. Yeah. It, he's chewing badly. Yeah. His poop suddenly <laughs> smells different. Yes. <laughs> oh my god. He's it's sweating in the nose. bed. Yeah. He's never he's using, you know, he like, comes I back from work you, early. Men are annoying. Men are annoying. Women are annoying. <laughs> Women are annoying. <laughs> <laughs> Women too. Me I have me I have a, a person. He, my partner is the kind of person at a tour socks, Arusha pale. 3 days in a row. Mwangelele mm, socks. He's doing it. So my mom asked me why not utwangi tu kwani kutoa socks ni kitu kingumu it is just about learning to be with someone and it is it is mm. it is up until uanze kuishi na mtu yeye advice yangu ina kuanga yes maybe it's not as vile inafaa kukua but mimi my advice is ishi na mtu before muone ndio juu mtu ni muone because sa zingine wewe tu uko huku uko Alafu you already tied to a marriage. By the way unaanza ku realize this is not what I want. And you can walk out. That's true. Sasa watu wa tulikuja tukakula mchele huko tukawachangia. Eh mimi even if people go and dance at home the day I want to leave I will leave. Mm. But that is a yeah. bit unfair because you had your time to It's not unfair. Na Things change. Let me tell you. You're not seeing that umtu kwanza you know kama This goes back to what oh. we already said. Kuna that? seasons. Mm-hmm. The person he is today yeah, yeah, yeah. when you're trying it out mm-hmm. is not the person he's going to be when he becomes a father. He's not the same person he's going to be when he loses his job. He's not the same person he's going to be when you become sick. He's not the same person he's going to be when his parents die. But don't you think uh, So things someone, change. Okay, no, with, 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 with there are situations mm-hmm. you never foresee coming. Yeah. So you can't ju- judge and how he's going to be. Yes. The people who lose their parents and they're depressed for the rest of their life. Oh God. How are you going to deal with such a person? Those are things you never preempt coming. Yeah. At, at least that one we can see coming. Parents die. Him losing his job. Most people yeah, your permanent and pension and then losing yes. a part of his body now. Yes, you exactly. <gasps> Or you that? you that getting I have, sick i have you know so these so things you really can't say my dad was in an accident a while back and uh, i was the one who was taking care of him and i can tell you already kuishi na mtu inapatia gauge ya who this person is my dad was a very angry person when he got his accident he was just grumpy umempiki ugali ataki ugali sasa nataka so did your mom have an experience of that before they got married yes already we know my dad anakwanga like my dad is a certain kind of person you know he's he's late he's i love him to death but sometimes he can just be you know you know and we know that because to me she na tunajua aya angalia in terms of me me she na after marriage i am i am by no ni wale waliingia alafu marriage ka no this is your perspective this is not your mom's perspective With so me, probably the way your dad was with, with, before with, they got married and after marriage is really different. With my man, uh, with my partner, I can gauge that akikasirika anakuanga hivi. Akiwa happy anakuanga hivi. Of course I could lose job. I am foreseeing something, you know. Mm-hmm. Kuliko tunakaanga tu across the table tukikunywa coffee, I really don't know this person. Do you believe in that that you can foresee some things before you get married? I I believe so. Yes. I don't believe because I be- I, even I, myself yeah. the things i used to say i can never do i do them these days 
No, 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 that's a different, you not know, the yeah. big so, thing. Yeah. he never saw that side of me. Yeah. I'm no, the I'm kind of person engage, when I'm engaging. sad. This never used to happen before. Before when I was sad, I would go out. These days when I'm sad, I don't shower, I stay in the house, I don't do my just I didn't know I, even myself I didn't know that side of me. But so if he wants to say no, that no, side no, side that no, side no, side no, so you see these are things he could not foresee. So saying that you live with somebody before marriage. Before marriage these are things before but I can, I can attest to living with someone before marriage yeah. because I moved in and moved out yeah. with mm-hmm. an ex. I think those and ones near about basics be to come a quicker socks of which those ones to me I find them disrespectful. No, they're, they're no also, it they're was also, there were yeah. there were very deep gauge, things like mm-hmm. it was only that I when I lived with him mm-hmm. that I realized I cannot communicate. Yeah. Mm-hmm. When something happens, I shut down. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And I've not talked to this person for a week. And I just don't know. Every time I try to bring up the words to describe how I'm feeling, I'd cry and I can't bring it out. And that's something I also did not know. Mm-hmm. And that was training for him yeah. as someone who's trying to understand what do I do with this person? What, And then for me, in that living with him is when I realized I have to work on self. Because yeah. every single thing would trigger a trauma from my parents' yeah. home. Mm-hmm. And for us, when we were having that strain, apparently that was the time he cheated. I only get, got mm-hmm. to learn later, mm-hmm. but that was the time he cheated. So I was imagining if I was in this situation, now married and probably these kids added to, I don't know. I just thought I was so lucky to have had that preview mm-hmm. before. So for me, I, and before I wouldn't have, I would have never seen mm-hmm. any of these things. He'd have never seen me like that. Everyone who knows me knows me as the TikTok personality. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Very bubbly, very happy, a lot of energy. Yeah. So I was thinking it, you need to be put in a certain yeah. space where you're so safe that yeah. you, your true self comes out. For me, I would say. And then you can be able to gauge whether this is something we're, li- we're willing to, to live to with our coffee. entire lives. To kick out, to kick out your coffee you've only heard of I'm bipolar, you've only heard of bipolar. So he was like, no, bipolar can't be that bad. You know, mm-hmm. it can't be that bad. And I was like, only the people who have lived with me. So when he proposed to Anze Kushi Pamoja, it is only then. And it is it's okay if you did not sign up for this. Because I wouldn't like, okay, to make an amapete, uko ndiyo tumeenda, tumeenda kushi pamoja. From across the coffee table, you don't, you can't tell that I break down. I lost my sister two weeks ago, and I can promise you, I, we did not foresee we did not foresee it coming. But he has an idea of how I grieve. He has an idea of how low I can get. He has an idea of how high I can get. So anajua how to move. You know, ni kunywe dawa bado, ni fanye hi, ni fanye hile. Kama ange kwa maishi na mimi, hange jua, I have laws. It is physically hard to cook. Unona, and I do those are the days. <laughs> ata, ata, ata. Because I love, I'm a chef. I love to cook. But at the end of the day, ata ona, wa, enye, mama yuko sawa. And he will take out. Unona, rather mm. than, imagine ngefanyika to make a pete, like maybe last month, then my sister passes away two weeks ago. Then do ananza kuno this guy who you kuna sata amka because with I feel like bipolar will prepare to a certain level, and I told him it is okay if you do not sign. Even up. for them to leave, like yeah, they they have you. a preview and then they can yes. leave because let me ask you, you the guy you live with, with how yeah, long yeah. had you dated? It was a very short time actually. Exactly, and also because for me my idea of dating because I felt like. By the time we were moving in together, mm-hmm. I already had an experience of living with him without necessarily moving my oh, place you into to him. his place, him being yes. your place. Okay. We used to see, he would come from work at 11, pass by my house to pick food. It was, mm. we were in so each other's space so much. I had already met his family. Mm. I had seen him through so many situations mm. that I felt dating already prepared me so you felt yes. you were yeah okay. yeah so i could have gotten married mm. that time 
Maybe that's the perspective that I didn't have yeah. that you've dated for a longer period. So yes. you've technically you've seen this person you've seen, through, yeah. yeah, you've seen them lose a loved one, you've planned trips that have failed, you've seen them mm-hmm. get conned, mm-hmm. you've seen them have issues oh, at you've work. Seen, you've seen you've him, seen him his... promoted at work. You also know how he handles money. Mm. You've seen a Kim in almost every phase. But, but still, to... I feel that did not prepare me enough for the things that I learned when I started living with him. But still, you had yeah, I think with the, pre- with the preview, a preview, you signed in with enough information yes. that I'm willing to. Yes, I'm so I'm, to stay with I'm against people saying I'm against you saying mm-hmm. that you have to live with somebody else. But you have, I think, I just phrase, date, be friends with someone before you start dating. I think friends, you'd be lying yes. because no. the, yeah, because in those situations where me and my partner are to look at like what are we doing together. We always had friendships to lie on. And that is the only reason we are, we are together today. Because I know I can still talk to you as a friend. I know I mm-hmm. can count on you as a friend. We show us the relationships. Umeliko sana jana. Lea tu umeenda hosi. Na umtu ata ajali. Jua koleksi jana tuliko sana. But when they're your friend, they're like, I have to be there for you still friend. You still show up. Yes, even they, if... they still care. Mm. A friend will care. Alafu, your relationships ingine zi bounce back from like really bad situations. Me, weka sayi, tuseme we've been friends for five years. Yeah? Na tumeko sanya kitu kama maybe we were supposed to meet na kani chelewesha. Mm-hmm. Are we going to break up as friends? I'm very petty. <laughs> <laughs> but in, in, in those relationships where you want to keep, see we will just figure it out. Yeah, talk, so for me I would rephrase it as be... Mm-hmm. Be intentional yeah, and intentional. decide yeah. because also friendships end. Yeah. So, what my person says is, I I made a decision. I chose. This is I what chose, I yeah. want. Yeah. yeah. And him, he says, if we can be happy, five. I only, he only wants five or four days a week. Mm. Those three mm. days, do whatever you want. Hang out with your <laughs> friends. Call your mom for three hours. If you feel you are unhappy, so he says, if you can only be happy four days mm. a week. Yeah. Yeah. Then you've made it. Yeah. So at uh, the thing about some days it's not working. I th- it That's happens. Life. Yeah. yeah, it happens. <laughs> and nothing prepares you for anything. Nothing will prepare yes. you enough. People change. Even myself, yeah. I do some things right now. I'm like, is that me? Mm. So nothing will ever prepare you. And then especially with women, your body changes, your hormones changes. Mm. <laughs> That's true. Do you know the other day I cried over fries? <laughs> <laughs> and it's I was possible. ready to leave. Yeah. So I made fries. I like my fries like very, very, very crunchy. Mm-hmm. He doesn't mind. Actually, it wasn't him. Let me just be honest. It was his mm-hmm. sister. Oh, okay. So I made my fries and put them. Mm-hmm. Tell me why this lady came and picked mine. <laughs> This man no, no, cool. your sister ate yeah. my fries. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I was so upset. So those are things that if you had yeah. asked me I'm one sorry. year down, no. and actually that time I would willingly give out my food mm-hmm. to his sister. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Why was I upset that day about fries? You just mm-hmm. had other issues also. So I yeah. nobody can tell you, you that can. some things will prepare A you. Lot of things yes, change. yes. Things change, but if you guys are very intentional and see the value in your relationship will make it work if there's no value then you guys will leave mm. yeah and don't ever be ashamed about working out even if it's a marriage yes sure i work out for the right reasons so it's not really good at you for it but it's all totally wonderful see nimesema i saw the value and <laughs> yeah. decided yeah. to work yes. at the end of the day it's, it's, it's choosing your person mm-hmm. over and over and over mm-hmm. and over again That's every day what I've had, you have yeah. to wake up Look at him. Atakama akona kichwa kubwa yosiku. Atakama na chew the loudest yosiku. Look at him, him and say, I choose you. Eh, my lord. I and left it's hard. It's like it's your hard. job. You, yeah. you you slept late the previous night. Yeah. There's so much traffic. It's raining. You mm-hmm. have a deadline. But you still go because you see value. You see what your job is doing in your life. You're able to pay your car. Crazy about you. That I will never stop saying. Have a man who is crazy (laughs) about you. Look at the way. You know, I am so in love with how people look at each other. 
I see sometimes like we have friends around and I'm I'm talking, maybe I'm talking or we're just listening to music and I turn and I see oh, your man, man looking at you. And I'm like I think he knows you enjoy it, so he's probably no, but doing this, it. Uh, this is the first time I'm actually saying it. Do I'm like lucky, how do you think blue nani nara cuz and I've seen also my sister used to tell me there's a way he looks at you that that's that's how my grandfather ah, anangalianga ah, 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 so i have seen it have, and they've been married for so long yeah. and it works so mm. there's a way i can just be talking uh, to people and i'm like you know and i just turn and there's a way he's looking at me and i'm just like i i also want to be looked at yes, as you like are. that well I, me I, i'm very disconnected from love me, I, I think you look at me like that and i would not even notice because you would not, not you would not it's not like it's really. not yes. something you're looking for, for you yes, yes. then yeah you there's a yeah. single lady who came last week and she was saying she wants the 90s kind of love she wants mm. a fairy tale mm. she wants walks on the beach she wants to yeah, be adored and admired. Yes. yes so i guess yeah i can me, for me it is seven ikifika seven june put off our phones like the company no using our phones we put on a nice movie and we will comment it and we love horror we, mm-hmm. we had to because nilimpata kwa hivyo na mimi kwa hivyo so our movies you at ukiwa our friends you know we watch horrors and we watch it together we just scooch in a couch pamoja we as scary as it is as what mm. any it is just our That's your thing. Yeah, it's your thing. Yeah, it's your thing. Yeah, we wouldn't walk thing. on the beach or anything, but I know. That's what I'm saying. As long as he lets me pick the movies because he's testing music. Any movies is just pathetic. So, me I choose the movies. So I know hata kama amenikasirikiana hataki kuniongelesha. Do you do the movie and he'll be like, "Umejua." Mm-hmm. You know, a conversation will spark. Because on those days when you don't know this person because ndo nakwambia not only coffee dates coffee date mnakunywa tu hapo kahawa ujue hata na chiwingiaje au oh, juice socks za ni kwanza miguu kunuka oh god just be all that someone. note yeah just be with someone who you can soma pole pole all that note mhm when i was doing the hygiene episode we realized first day tuko mwanzo mwanzo please do if your person showers yeah. wipes like yeah. basics because mm-hmm. i'm thinking there's this been dilemmas people sending dilemmas to celebrities late, of late and i'm just mm-hmm. thinking are we willing to compromise on hygiene yeah. in a marriage let's let's not look at i know he's a good communicator he's a good this he's a good that am i willing to date someone who doesn't wipe who lives mm-hmm. to be what? honest some of these things goes back to what we were saying about upbringing upbringing mm. yeah the people when they were being brought up there was not even toothpaste oh. tissue so mm. they would tissue. brush their teeth Where? when it happens mm. so this is one person who right now mm-hmm. maybe because of high school mm-hmm. they brush once a day You know I I I also saw that and they don't even realize it's a huge thing. No, I I saw that perspective and to me I thought to myself this is not someone I'd pick because as you've said change is inevitable we all change yes. we all evolve. Yeah. I never used to exfoliate. I didn't know exfoliating was a thing. It's yeah. come juicy. Mm. I've adopted it. I'm now exfoliating. Yes. I never knew we scrub our bodies. Now I've adopted yeah. scrubbing. Like as when we grew up it was your panty, you use it, yes, you wash your, your body, body. Yes. and so long as you're clean, you get to a point where you're like, "Oh, people are using scrubbers. You yes. use scrubbers." People are using I'm thinking you've evolved. You've grown into a world where you've realized people are now using tissues and bidets. You want to tell me that it's because the way you were raised? No. I'm telling you could be <laughs> it could, could be. be yes, yes. I understand. Yes. so what you need to identify is is this somebody who doesn't know no yeah. wiping yourself that when even in the village people mm. use uh, mm. the the leaves mm. the leaves yeah so there are things like flossing your teeth mm. but especially and then also men don't look out don't go out looking for hygiene tips mm. yeah they don't it doesn't even pop in their feed You know the way you you'll go to uh your TikTok and somebody's telling you how to clean this, how to do this. They don't mm-hmm. have it. So it's you to tell them these things. And that's why this dating, you go to this guy's house, 
is a side drawer does not have uh, wet wipes, what are you going to use after sex? Mm. And you should tell him <laughs> there's a difference between the flushable ones uh, and the scented are. ones. Tell him tell him all these things. They don't know. How old are you? Which are these women who you've dated before and why is it have you dated someone who you you know, uses Some of them are mm. they just don't know. Yeah. And like I'm Mimi Nili Uliza, choose. what's the difference between a WhatsApp? Actually, he prefers the other one because it smells nice. Kuna vitu pia utafundisha mwanaume. But there's, there's a... There's and then, I feel like you you will always teach each other things. Yeah. Yes. There are things I'm just not willing to. There are things that mm-hmm. are basic, yeah, like not really using a roll-on. Uh, uh, yeah. Hygiene is not... Uh, you have to compromise. You have to be clean. Because Babu, Mr. Tembea na wena unanuka, shuwali... I think I think Zaku Zakuoga I I found it okay. The poor so one is where me? I don't I'm just like you Una couldn't manke? have grown all these years. No, that one that one is just no, a dirty yeah. person. Yeah. Cuz me the only people on anga jisuguangi are white people cuz they they put on their body wash and, and then they, they just do this. yeah. No, yeah. even there's some black me, people who don't scrub their body. Alikuwa na kusugua kwanza baka yeye anashadi dhambi like amesugua everything mm. so when i grow up i know si kujishika shika na sabuni hivi ni unasugua mm. sababu alikuwa anatuambia we are light skin so if we don't shower well you'll turn yeah, dark kuna places itakuwa dark mm-hmm. do you want that as a light skin person no so as we were told we are, we are dark because we are dirty so you sugua wow <laughs> everyone we grew up with <laughs> you are just hearing this today. That's harsh. Oh, ah, uh, next kids. It's we've been at it for a while. <laughs> I think for me, we used to. Okay, most we used that to that have a, a house. Or or is it no, it was a it was a known notion. It was a known it was a known thing. And people will tell you. Oh, that was a thing. Like, like you are told. Eh, hey, don't play in the sun. sun. Yeah. Make sure you scrub your but body well so that you. Uh, it's, it's just past it's information you you are born and find there and you actually believe, believe it, it yeah because, because it's it. also light like skins we've been bullied for a while me growing up I wanted to be dark skin because being light was just not enough for people i wanted to hey, be dark urudi urudi ex- episode ya colorism because mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah uh, um let me see if there's something we've not covered someone said it takes a lot at times i miss days when i was single jewe fireworks and you're to now not to <laughs> you no, don't I miss your single days we all do Mm-mm. you we don't all do. we all do even the perfect relationship okay the people in my circle who had relationships they mm. all say that and even you sometimes miss. he'd say do you know tripping like this amount Oh yeah because when we're yeah. going on trips for me the preparation starts like three four days before mm. i have to go to adams to look for bikinis yeah i need a then new hat i need, I need a new hat every time we travel it's like Kuna z- but you will end a place you will end a place i have yeah. to get a new one all the time you have to go get waxed you I have to di- do your one. hair I've never wanted to be single ever at on those days when nilikuwa mwangala even on unda nyonga ni how is I it? just I don't know. I I've never wanted to be oh, for me that's so And that could is. it be because you 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 don't know a life of being single if I, you got I your do. child early? I do. There was okay. a time even when he was pursuing me there was a time I was single you, and I was yeah. just saying no because I knew I wasn't okay. Mm. So nilingoja kwanza nipa hivi. Which but nilingia tuna vidonda vingine but I have been single for a very long time before I started dating him. And now what okay maybe you might not have this picture but what if the relationship ends have you thought of how that would affect you Yes And do you think it will be It won't be easy mm. do not stay because you are scared of my mental health stay with me because you love me stay with me because you want to be with me I would I would I wouldn't stop him from leaving me I would never Mm. because if you don't want to be with me I'm not going to force you to be with me it is okay if you do not want to be with me but be intentional and I ask you this Allah. I'm just trying to understand mm-hmm. do you think the way you view 
eh mental health guys will come for me but anyway <laughs> do you think the way you view li- love and your relationship could be because of your mental health status mm. you don't think so fafanua ndio ni jua najibu nini like the way you've said you'd never you've never wanted to be single mm-hmm. do you feel b- that you enjoy the support that you enjoy that him it being there it was supporting because hata ndio tufike mahali ile bipolar and this is where i was telling him i would understand if he did not sign up for this i i had to teach him about bipolar so it wasn't always support at some point pia alikuwa ananiuliza kushwa hii bipolar si excuse to kwa kichwa mbaya you know the mood swings the what are you not just using So it wasn't always support it has taken time for me to teach him that this is this and this is this because si kila mtu amelelewa na mental health ikiwa kwa familia kuna watu wengine wanajuanga we bipolar hiyo ni mashetani look at a lot of muslims they don't even take their people to rehab they take them to madhari and mental places they don't just don't want to understand who is schizophrenic and as a side ka hivi na hivi na hivi so it's not about the support because mm. with support my mom is a psychologist my dad has had to learn everything he has to learn about mental illness for us so ingekuwa both love and support singewai kama singewai toka kwa wazazi wangu because my mom overdoes her love she just she wants us to know that it is okay not to be okay so mm-hmm. it is not about the support really it is just about i love him and he makes me a good person my partner is very positive even on those days when everything is just looking very negative he will look for something positive so i like what he makes me i like what i am with him i love it so i never want to entertain the thought that maybe naweza kosa kuwa naye but ikifika hapo na niambie by the way ina hiyo i work for me na tuone nyenye ni kitu siwezi badilisha mm-hmm. because i had to stop drinking at some point because of, of all this i was losing myself mm-hmm. and at that point i didn't understand that eh anataka tu ni kuntu nzuri mimi tu nilikuwa like u anataka tu niache pombe but after ni niache pombe you see it's, it's about what this person makes you to be so if he makes you happy then it is just about that happiness and about that love and who it makes you as a person because i was a very negative person and right now i can view life in a very positive way okay and for you, you you've said what about single who do you miss ah uh, everything <laughs> <laughs> what the other day i was hosting my brother was it two weekends ago Then my small brother said he misses me single my single hood was lit lit ah, i miss the freedom like today why yeah. am i going for movies in aboretum mm. i'll be doing other things but is it just because of the freedom no i'm saying things that i miss i miss mm-hmm. the freedom mm-hmm. that and the spontaneity that i could do anything i want at yeah like now if i'm um, to maybe go for dinner on tuesday i'm like did you is that i'm going for dinner on tuesday mm-hmm. so don't make plans with me oh, okay mm. there is always that oh they like just inform like keep yes keep yeah, yeah 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 then december we are going this place i can't just decide no i'm not going to this place like last like my previous years my mom never knew if i was coming home for december or not mm. but him also being a man and also being like a fast one in the family mm-hmm. the things he has to do at a certain time so you just know this time you're going home mm-hmm. Mimi, i would go home when i go home when you go yeah yes i would go home when i go and then home and i could change plans like i could change said, yes yeah. i would tell my mom i'm not coming to patane mombasa me i'm not coming home and that would work right now there's so many people involved so when your schedule can't just change yeah, you like around. that yeah you're not as flexible yes as you then i miss possible. my lazy days Mm. Like I would just wake up and be naked and sit there the whole day. Right now it's it's not possible. Why? Oh, even on a like on a day when both of you are doing nothing, just chill. Mm. No, 
um you see because i do that a lot it's not possible not because <laughs> yes like he it's not the same when somebody else is around that things yeah, i want to I do get it. Mm-hmm. yes that but things i want you you can't just sit naked I'm not even comfortable to sit naked like this Why? when he's seated. I'm not. But he sees you naked all day. Yes, but he doesn't see me seated naked for <laughs> three hours. Oh, yeah. <laughs> then I am in a very weird relationship. Yeah, I, I'm not comfortable yeah. exposing myself like that. Oh. Yes. That's like, strange. It makes sense. I do understand. Really? Yeah. yeah. I, I'm not comfortable like that. Of I'll wear a short, I'll wear a t-shirt, but all naked? No, I can't do it. Yes. I miss <laughs> you're in a happy relationship. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, because I can promise you, we live like not hippies really, but we are so free with each other to a point where it's actually normal. Okay, One of it's the reasons not. I can't give up this relationship is because this is the most I don't even know. Free how to you been? Yes, with my past relationship, I never, I never farted in front of that guy. And um, mm. it was just uh, even staying naked was just a problem. In this relationship, there's literally nothing I can't do. This is someone who will see me in the Sahau pad room, like we can da kuchange ani lete yo ingine. He won't mm. be like e. Uh. No, that's fine. In my that's, previous that's, one, that's it was okay. how do you just guys remove blood? It was never comfortable. Mm. With this one, it's just. Ebu ambaka kuna sukari nyingi. Ebu ni nikite tampon ina kanga. So you put it in a bottle of water. He sees it. You know. That's a no, that is that is so normal. Just no one. Uh-huh. I hope your ex has evolved because I don't wish that on another woman. <laughs> <laughs> I would I would say I really hope he has evolved yeah. because or maybe I was just not very comfortable with him. Because mm. yeah. with him it was But just, if he said things like those, I mean, how it would you be? It was weird, yeah. man. It was just, how do you just shed off dirty blood? And I'm like, oh, eh, okay. Ukusi mali. Atandasema ni kinyasha. I'll just mm. go home ni kinyasha. It was that bad. Mm. Okay. So the kind of freedom you're talking about, the one that you miss, is the one I crave in mine. Okay, it's not that anybody is stopping me from being naked. <laughs> it's just I get I, I can't. you. Yeah, I get yeah, you. I can't true. explain it, yes, but I get I can't. you. Yeah, <laughs> I miss my toilet moments. Yeah, I would stay in the toilet. I don't know what's with me, but I can't. I can't go to the toilet without my phone. Mm. Yeah, mm. that's everyone. Yeah. No, so these me. days, I can't be in there for like two hours. It'd be like, hey, uko sawa. Oh yeah. yeah, and the moment you know Uncle Kosawa, I become conscious. I've been you're... here for an hour. Yeah, I need yeah, to. Yeah. I need to get out. Me too. Kika sana na kujana na kana we ukona ni figure. Iyo kujana kukana mimi is you've already interfered with me. Yes, it was there. Yeah, I'm now conscious that I've been here for this long. Now it changes things. Yeah. I'm, it changes things. Mm-hmm. I want to be there by myself. Oh, okay. Yeah. Also, you value your privacy. Yes, I do. I do. I you do. Want I your... do. I do. Yeah, there's people who've said that they are married or rather they're in relationships and they live together, but they really still want their space. Yeah. Like they are, there's still people who like their space. I really do like my space so much to the point that when we were moving out, I told him the, the smallest house we can live in is a two bedroom. Mm, it makes sense. Yes, and for now we we have a three bed. He stays in his office most of the time when he's home. He has another bedroom with all his clothes. We don't mix our clothes together mm-hmm. because it's it becomes so irritating for me. Mm-hmm. You come like my panties are folded, my socks are separately. Mm-hmm. You come pick your boxer from where it yeah, is, yeah, and, and then you unravel the else, whole thing. Yeah. I will kill you. So <laughs> just have I your own space. It. Have it messed may see the way you want so those are the kind of things that mm. I, i miss i also miss can you shower with your man yes your yeah They're but not so every weird. day because there are times i just want to shower differently in the showering for tara you can't shower with me, someone yeah me, me, me. <laughs> no showering for tara i don't mind help for tara like i need yes. to exfoliate and yes. everything. i prefer showering together when i'm showering yeah. for tara oh. because now i'm just a princess that you do yeah. the things They For sure, you, yeah. yes. Like your car, you got to like ah, so go. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Maybe, maybe have, now I'm convinced. I, I yeah. Sharing for Sarah. Like but my man is very clingy, and 
I don't I've, I've never been someone who liked PDA before this. Because for the longest time my <laughs> ex used to hold my hand to prove that he's with me when mm. he sees other guys in. But then afterwards I go like mbono na nishika mkono like he made me hate myself What's so much. Yeah, kwanza after I gave back ali niambia na ka jojo tank and I was just getting thick. But I hated the fact that I was thick. So mm. the guy I got afterwards eh hey, my mom is cleaning. He will act like a baby when I'm home. Like he will like kabisa. Mm. So akunanga hiyo boundary at he but yes does my the job na kwa sababu at our weekends ndio tuna spending most time together iki feel na need my space na ndang home mm. to my mom's place oh. because there i can just you know think but you said you don't you don't mind him being no, around say, your space yes. all the time yes i don't but sometimes then why do you need to go back in yesha unaanza na tuko msungua i become very fit bora una kumwa na nguvu bora una chiwizo bora hivyo it's mm. it's more about me than it is about, about him. him okay Yeah, ni mimi ndo ndanza kumtafutia makosa niko like hiyo kichwa tu inakaanga tu hivyo hizo miguu zinakaanga tu hivyo like i just become something else so don't you see <sighs> for i go away yeah, well i don't that <laughs> i have not experience we and just relationships are different we, i guess the, the times we don't even communicate you can just sense the other person needs peace Mm. Yeah. yeah so he is having stresses my sabuzaki has been gani there's a project he's working on he's not going the way he wants he'll just go to his office close it off mm. I, i i don't go in there mm. to bother him i think during those difficult Then, times shows where i'm like i'm just going to be with you 